Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. It's Jimmy here, also known as Envirostyle Apparel. Sorry I've been away for a while. As we all know, there has not been a lot going on. Lockdown and everything else. We have had to self-isolate here for 14 days because my little boy had symptoms. He'd already had two COVID tests and he was so traumatised by those, we didn't want to put him for another one, so we had to self-isolate for 14 days, all of us, which, yeah, to be fair, we're pretty cool about it, so we've <laughs> that's what's been going on here. So, not a lot to report. I was going to do a Q&A um, DVD. Wow, not that famous. <laughs> anyway, I was going to be doing a Q&A DVD, and um, it just didn't happen. It was one thing after another, as it is around this time of year anyway. But with everything what's going on, yeah, not been in the best of moods. So I'm back anyway, and I thought, I'll do this video. I'll try and bang it on before Christmas. Hopefully, we'll see. Might put it on in between Christmas and New Year where everything's quiet. But I would like to thank all my new subscribers and all my old subscribers. <laughs> Don't want to call you that. My loyal subscribers, everybody that is subscribing to me and putting up with waiting for my videos and actually getting some use out of my videos. Thank you very much for being here. I really appreciate it. Um, I've been getting some lovely messages on Instagram from different people, which is so lovely to get. So keep them coming. I like to hear from you. Um, I've had a lot of really great feedback from my videos. So if any of you have this is the first one you're watching go back and have a look on my channel because apparently i've got some really good stuff there who knew <laughs> anyway i'm not going to bore you any longer so what i'm here for is my husband went out yes not yesterday day before yesterday and there were some charity shops open so he popped in and he bought me a few things so i thought i would do a quick video to show what he got me um it isn't gonna be really long unless I decide to ramble on like I have done so far. Um, oh, and I have a special guest today, Susan. Say hello, people. I also want to hear in the comments if anybody has bought anything really good while they've been going out over whatever tea you're in. Um, don't think anybody was out during lockdown because I think everywhere was shut. But have you found anything really cool that you're going to sell? And also, let me know what you got for Christmas. I am real excited for Christmas. We're actually now, um, as I'm recording this, it is the 23rd of December. So as you can see, I've got all these gifts behind me. They will be gone soon, thank God. Our bedroom looks like Santa's grotto at the moment. But yeah, so... That's what day it is, and hopefully I will get this out the same day, but who knows. Anyway, I'm going to show you what he bought me. He's pretty good at shopping for me, so I can't grumble. So what I'm going to do, I've got some shoes. And what I'm going to do with these shoes, I'm going to tell you the prices and then tell you what I'm going to do with them. Yeah, well, that's the general idea, isn't it? God, you can tell I ain't done this for a while. I've been so unprofessional. Anyway, he bought me these. And I, I didn't just get one shoe. <laughs> Two shoes. There we go. Some Nike. I won't show you both, but they're just basically Nike. Tick side. Like a... I don't even know what you call that. Maybe a spray effect front. There's like a rubber bit round here. Black laces. Very nice condition. Still plenty of tread plenty of tread why can't i talk today oh my god i haven't had a drink i promise i've been out this morning if any of you watch my instagram or even my facebook um i don't normally go on facebook anymore but i did a video to say merry christmas to everybody today and i did it while i was outside waiting for my daughter to come out of the orthodontist so yeah that's what i've been doing this morning i got up early very early <laughs> for me at the moment anyway right these are a size five um, I don't know if you can see that and I do apologise about my nails. I haven't checked anything before I started doing this video. I've probably got really disgusting dirty nails. I've got eczema all over my hands from using sanitizer and washing them constantly. Absolute nightmare. Um, yeah, so anyway, got these. He spent, I think these were £1, they worked out £1.25 each. 
all of these items i believe or the ones that i'm going to show you anyway first so he got me those and then these ones i've got a pair of these that are my daughter's on my ebay already um got plenty of interest just haven't gone yet but these are a size four which i believe are the same size as the ones i've already got good tread again so yeah um again these were 125 for the pair so my nike trainers i'm normally going to be putting these on 15 pound or best offer i'll accept offers over 10 pounds i think i don't go too high with them because i find that there's a lot on there and it's quite hard to shift um, and i want to get rid of them basically i've got loads of trainers but yeah i've got these also these new balance ones these are nice they're like a gray suede with the pink lettering and detailing a bit of rubber around the back um new balance on the back white laces hardly been worn really nice tread um these if i can get them out these are a five as well i can't show you the size because they're right in there but trust me when i say these are a size five um they look like they haven't particularly been worn very much now i'm probably i'm just going to check the next ones before i give you a price again these were 125 each i've got another pair here right i believe these are new balance as well all terrian fuel core um i think they are anywhere i'm sure hubby said they were but they've got good treads again they're a nice color a really nice like blue nice blue color with the nice snazzy laces um these are a size five too so you can see that label i believe these are new balance i think they are i will have to double check because i don't see anywhere actually saying new balance it probably does say it somewhere but i just can't see it anyway what i'm going to do with these babies is i'm going to bundle them up because they're the same size i was going to do that with the nikes but one pair of nikes is a four and one is a five so i can't do that so they've ruined my plan but what i could do is bundle up the four with the other size four i've got and then sell the other one separately i might do that so i might just redo the post for the other ones but yeah i'm going to put these on for, i think for about 30 40 pound for the two pairs let me know what you think in the comments i think these are pretty good one pound 25 pair you can't go wrong now to the clothes okay so this oh hang on hang on i need to make sure these have all got labels in because i think they're all from a different shop right this was 125 this is phase eight size 18 and it's like a crochet almost like a it's a netted crochet type arm quite thick it's layered um and it's a top black and white anyone knows what this pattern is hit me up it looks like dog tooth but i don't think that's what you'd call it in this but please correct me if i'm wrong lovely lacy sleeve now this was 125 i'm probably going to put it on for 21.99 or best offer i will accept offers of 15. so yeah that's pretty nice now these oh this was 125 as well now i'm going to show you this last because it's pretty cool um yeah i'll show you that last so what i've got here is this was four pounds it is jerry weber and it is a um acrylic and polyamide cardigan it's very heavy very nice quality material it's a nice sort of i've forgotten what you call this knit but it's quite chunky but i don't think it is chunky knit i think it is got has got a special name for it so again if you know stick it in the comments lovely big chunky buttons which julie love julie love chunky buttons so yeah this is really nice it's the color see i wear this color but a lot of people i know think it's really drab but i know it'll go now i normally price jerry weber high but i haven't really been selling it <laughs> so <coughs> start choking now excuse me i'm gonna say that i'll probably he got me this for four so i'll probably put it on for 34.99 or best offer normally i'd stick it on nearer to 50 but i'm gonna try and get rid of it quick because why not you know 
we need the money over Christmas, shall we say? <laughs> we all know what it's like at the moment. This one was three pounds. It is a size 14 LK Bennett jacket. I'm sure it's linen. Can you see that? Look, it's... Ooh. <laughs> anyway, this is really cute. It's like a hot pink. Um, there is no fastening on the front. So it's like just an open front. Um, cropped, short sleeved, like a wedding style jacket. And it's got this lovely burr on the back. I think it's really pretty don't think there's anything wrong with it um haven't seen pardon me oh dear i haven't seen anything up to now excuse me guys oh it's 51 percent silk 49 percent linen bonus yeah love that so yeah that is really nice i'll probably put that on 40 to 50 nearest offer see how it goes I can tend to aim a bit too high with LK Bennett, but because that's really cute and it's nice, it's in good condition, it's silk and it's linen, why not aim high? Right, so this is a brand, it's the last thing. This is a brand that my husband bought me that I've never heard of and I was a bit like, what you bought me this for? Anyway, I Googled it and I was quite shocked. So this, this is what I mean about was always learning. Don't just assume that you know everything because there's always brands out there you've never heard of. It's called Weatherall. Now, these are selling on eBay for quite a lot of money. And the longer coats are selling for a lot more. I'm probably going to put this on. Bearing in mind it was £1.25. I'm probably going to put this on for around the £50 mark. Um, as long as it's got no blemishes. But it's like a sheepskin jacket. If you can see there, it's quite short. Hello. Oh no, you see my chin's like that, look. <laughs> oh dear. Anyway, turn up sleeves, pockets. Do I, do oh no, it's not a pocket. Oh, you can actually, you put your hand into it and it's not a pocket. Well, it must be just to keep your hand warm inside or you could be one of those flasher type people, I suppose. Same on both sides, that's weird. Oh, there is a pocket. Hang on, hang on. Oh, there you go, look. There's a label. I think this is vintage. Whether all made in England. 75% wool, 25% nylon, size 12. Yeah, so there are pockets, but you can go behind the pockets and, you know, do whatever you need to do. I suppose it's good if you've got an itch. <laughs> anyway. I think it's pretty cool. Um, I don't know how quickly it's going to sell. I don't think it's got any marks on it as such. There's a couple of little bits, but nothing major. So I'm thinking £50, I can easily achieve for that. Let me know what you think. Have you had any dealings with this brand? Um, has it sold for you? Have you seen it sell for other people? Have you bought it before brand new? Do you know about it? I like to know these things because I have never heard of it. I'm just fastening it up to show you what it looks like properly. I'm not going to put it on because I'm not a size 12. <laughs> Especially in a vintage. But yeah, there you go. So it's got collar like this. And buttons like that. It's very cute. Very nice. Again, funny colour, but people like the natural colours i do i wear a lot of black i wear a lot of creams and beiges and browns makes me sound real boring doesn't it but i do well i like those sort of colours um just for lounging around and stuff and greys i like greys but yeah um let me know what you think would you have bought those things do you think i've done well pricing wise what do you reckon let me know Write in the comments. Let me know what you got for Christmas. Merry Christmas, everybody. I hope you have a wonderful Christmas and New Year. Um, I am going to try and do my Q&A video at some point in the next few days as well. So if you have any questions for me, go onto my Instagram, send me a message. And I'll just think you're being nosy. No, I won't really. <laughs> Anyway, if you have liked this video, please give me a big thumbs up. It helps me out loads. Like and subscribe. Hit that bell. And I will be back on the regular content as soon as I can get out of this place.
Mwah. See y'all later, guys. Bye-bye.